Okay guys, I've been seeing a lot of uh, videos where people can't figure out how to get four factors of the same stat in a 150 or even 50 on the same accessory without it transforming into a percentage of either 3 or 5%. So I'm going to show you guys real quick how, how to do it and I'm going to put it on my ener or not energy, it. I'm going to put it on my attack amulet that uh, already has the 150 on here and I put already augmented uh, six laser rifles onto this so I can get an extra 600 to each damage and so let's get started so obviously you'll go to creation and augmenting and then I still haven't figured out a way to get the percentages on a weapon but if you guys can figure that out let me know because that is going to be even better uh, for doing this little trick because the way I do it you're going to wind up losing one of your augments or at least kind of feeling like it's a waste but in the long run you're going to get those four factors at 150 each so you put it on a sword or any other weapon that doesn't have any other augments and at least has three augmenting uh, capabilities you're going to then go to uh, using the first attack amulet Mission and then do this two more times. I'd buy it. Oops. Okay. <laughs> now that's done. Then you're gonna take uh, the best thing I found was it gives you the most stats is like one to attack two to defense is a blue amulet And let me see where mine is There it is or not amulet I apologize the blue talisman these charms are really crappy anyway, so anyway You'll take this and you'll use a nil paint. And that was me getting a text message. Anyway, you'll use a nil paint to remove that stat of that factor on here, as we need one with no factors on. So, and now we're going to change and add the sword that we just did. And now you see how it changed from. 150 to the five percent, but not to worry. Mm, we're gonna augment to that, <laughs> and now we're gonna go to the accessory we want to put it on, which I'm gonna put it on my attack amulet. Let's go find that blue talisman right there. All right, and as you can see, it transforms from the attack percentage of five to now 150 onto an amulet so and you can see I'm only gonna get an extra one to attack and two to defense normally if this could work right I would then get this put on as a uh, I'll, I would have 800 to attack an intelligence since I use the laser rifles to augment uh, the amulet even further but to do it this way How's you'll this? wind up you know using up an augment so you can't make it boost any more than that and it's gonna always gonna look weird with just an extra attack anyway now you have that then I'll go to my laser weapon yeah, I'll use this one to give myself an extra 100 to bolt <laughs> and there you have it 700 to each plus another 600 to damage gets me almost 4,000 to attack so and there you have it guys and then also if you guys don't know how to make the mind amulets or the attack amulets I'll show you real quick uh, the formula for synthesizing let's see actually I think I have them all okay here you go you'll use a wool one wire, vanilla bean, a signet card, 
and you could get away with this but it, from my opinion it doesn't work or you don't get them as much or as often but uh, I also add some gunpowder in makes it a little more expensive but uh, this quality is a lot better to do it this way and uh, it does take quite a bit but I used all 99 of each one and I got at least four or five mined amulets and about four attack amulets so I'll just show you real quick just run it through real fast That's it. there's a mine amulet right there <laughs> attack amulet right there and there you have it guys hope you enjoyed the video and also I guess I'll just add real quick if you guys don't know how to make this laser weapon, uh, first you're obviously going to need meteorite. And if you want to make meteorite, you use four bastard swords and a prime evil uh, fossil. And then save your game. If it doesn't make it the first time, reload it. But for my opinion, it works just about every time. So once I make one, I save. And then from there. And then from once you have a meteorite, you're going to take three actually micro blasters actually no I apologize you're gonna take four micro blasters and then you're going to uh, use one meteorite and then you're gonna do that and then that's gonna turn into a hadron uh, or actually I don't know if I pronounce that right it'll turn into Uh, sorry, Hadron Collider. It'll turn into one of those and then once you have that then you'll just take one of these off you'll use this and you'll use just one of these How's this? And that wasn't supposed to happen. Uh, so if it does not work the first time, obviously you're going to want to save your game first. But uh, give me a sec and I'll do this again. I mean, it doesn't always work on the first try or so, but I usually save and keep reloading until I get it. Success. There you go. Finally. Alright, and that's how you make a laser weapon, guys. I <laughs> well, hope you enjoyed the video. If you guys have any other questions, or if you figured out how to get that percentage on a weapon so that you can transfer it over to the amulet uh, that way, let me know, because then I could save one of my augments. Alright.